guys, this is Mark Asagata from Death Angel, and you're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News, and this is your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News report. Nightwish have now postponed their tour of Asia. This coming after Nightwish vocalist Flo Janssen stated she was cancer-free as she had a tumor removed after being diagnosed with cancer this year. The band posted, The last stage of getting Flo back to full health involves radiation therapy, which has been rescheduled from February to January. And so as a consequence, we are unable to come to Asia as scheduled. Don't panic. All of our team are working solidly on making sure we see you again. So all the best for Flo and a quick recovery from that. And the band Bush have announced a tour for 2023. It's a North American headline tour with support from Jerry Cantrell, Candlebox, and Silver Sun pickups on select dates. Pre-sales and VIP tickets are up now, as well as general public tickets. So that'd be a cool lineup. Steve Vai and Favored Nations mascot label group recently announced the release of the new Steve Vai album titled Vai Gash. It will be out digitally and on CD January the 27th. The vinyl album release will follow on February 24th. They have released a second preview of the upcoming album. You can now listen to the track Busted on digital retailers and streamers and YouTube. And Flyleaf fans rejoice. The United Flyleaf with vocalist Lacey Sturm has been announced for the 2023 Blue Ridge Rock Festival. That's going to be held September 7th to 10th in Altern, Virginia. They join Coal Chamber, Taproot, Cold, Edema, Finger 11, Dayseeker, and more. So that's great news for Flyleaf. Continuing with your maximum threshold.net rock and metal news. Who were some of the top bands that grossed the highest amounts in their tours in 2022? Well, Billboard have released some of their results. And some of the heavier ones and the rock ones are the Rolling Stones, 179 million, Red Hot Chili Peppers, 176 million, Def Leppard and Motley Crue, 173 million, Guns N' Roses are on there, My Chemical Romance, Iron Maiden, and Trans Siberian Orchestra. So great for all them. And the band Jag Panzer, they're set to release a new album. They have now signed with Atomic Fire Records for their upcoming new album titled The Hollowed, and that is set for the spring of 2023. And finally, Avatar, they've released a new music video for their song, The Dirt I'm Buried In. You can check it out now on YouTube. The second song off their new upcoming album called Dance, Devil, Dance, that's going to drop on February the 17th. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Z, and this has been your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News Report. Thanks for tuning in.